so welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video facial hair facial hair around the upper lips facial hair under the chin facial hair at the side right here that look unsightly on the face now if you're suffering with a lot of facial hair guess what i have a solution for you today i'm going to show you how you could use simple ingredient that you can basically find in your kitchen to whip up a hair inhibitor this hair inhibitor will help the hair growth to slow tremendously down now this hair inhibitor is a very strong inhibitor is gonna slowly get rid of that ear by sinking deep in the ear follicle, basically killing the root of the hair, causing the hair to fall out, and eventually you're gonna notice that the ear just don't grow back at all. However, you gotta be dedicated to this. You gotta use it at least two to three times per week for best result. So if you're looking to get rid of your unwanted facial hair, this video is for you. So come. Continue on. Now, before you apply your growth inhibitor, you want to make sure to cleanse the area first. Next, you're going to get a wash rug, put it in some warm or hot water, let it cool down a little, not too cool, cool enough to attach to the skin. Now, wherever you're trying to get rid of the hair from, you're going to take the wash rug and you're going to apply that warm wash rug to the area and you're going to leave it on for about a minute, okay? Now, what you're doing you're actually opening the pores so that the solution can be absorbed better into the skin to get deep into that ear follicles okay now once this is done you are ready to apply your growth inhibitor now you want to make sure to start this before you apply for this hair inhibitor i suggest you use a brush to apply you can use your hands but you definitely need a gloves now here is my brush so i'm just going to soak my brush up with the solution and the first place i'm going to apply mine is on my upper lips And this have a amazing smell not one that you would wear out more like a medicated smell the next my chin area Now, if you have hair on the chin, this is a wonderful treatment for the chin hair. It definitely is going to help you out a great deal. However, you want to use this on a regular on the chin to get rid of the chin hair. Now, once you apply this remedy to the skin, you're going to sit with it for about 30 minutes. Now, after 30 minutes, you're going to go and you're going to rinse this off with some warm water. The treatment is going to dry on the skin. So be mindful of that. Be mindful of where you wear this treatment. Do not wear it around your white stuff. It definitely will stain the stuff. So I'm going to sit with this for 30 minutes. Now, if you want to know how I made this ear inhibitor recipe and the ingredients, values, and properties, then continue continue watching the video. Our first ingredient is turmeric powder. And turmeric powder, when used on facial hair, will help to slow the growth process down. With continuous use of turmeric powder, you will eventually get rid of your facial hair. Our next ingredient is lemon, and lemon contains citric acid. With the citric acid and the turmeric powder, the combination is going to help to speed up the process of getting rid of your unwanted facial hair. Our next ingredient is lavender oil, and this is lavender essential oil. Lavender essential oil is known to help to inhibit hair growth and significantly reduce the growth of excess hair, especially on the face and body. And our final ingredient is 
tea tree oil and this is another wonderful oil for slowing the hair go down tea tree oil have antibacterial anti-inflammatory properties it also have property that can also inhibit the hair growth so i'm going to mix all the ingredients together to create a powerful anti-inflammatory hair remover for facial hair now just watch how i prepare these you're not going to just throw them together it actually is a process so just continue watching now the first thing i'm going to do i'm going to prepare the lemon and i'm going to zest the lemon since i'm going to use lemon zest and lemon juice to zest the lemon you need a grater and just rub the lemon on the grater like i'm showing here if you do not have fresh lemon zest go ahead and use some lime zest in this recipe you do not need a lot okay and here we have our lemon zest and now we're going to move on to taking care of the lemon so this is a large lemon i'm using about a half of a large lemon and the first thing i'm going to do i'm going to squeeze my lemon since i'm extracting the lemon juice in this recipe i'm not going to use any form of a water the juice from the lemon is all i'm using you want to remove the seeds now once the seeds are removed here we have our fresh squeezed lemon juice and as i said this is about three tablespoons of lemon juice moving on to preparing our hair remover treatment and here we have our lemon zest which is about a teaspoon of lemon zest more or less and now i'm just gonna mix the lemon zest with the lemon to create a very strong solution next I'm reaching for my tea tree oil and I'm using about 10 drops of tea tree oil. Yes, we're using a lot because we're making this very strong. About 10 drops of tea tree oil. And for our lavender oil, we're doing the same. We're using about 10 drops. And the lavender oil also is going to help this to have a very pleasant smell. And now we're going to blend together and it's gonna seem a little thick guys that's okay the oil mixed with the lemon zest and the lemon is gonna thicken up somewhat next we're gonna move on to the main ingredient and it is the turmeric powder now we're gonna start off with two half of a teaspoon of turmeric powder and then we're just gonna blend this in And this does not need to be very thick since it's not a process of pulling off the hair but it's a process of softening the hair which will, will eventually stop the hair from growing it will penetrate deep in the ear follicle basically you know killing the root of the hair and prevent it from growing back okay if you, so now our facial hair remover is ready so there you have it give this facial hair removal remedy a go give it a try use it for a couple of weeks come back and leave your comments thank you all for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to share the video and leave your comments and if this was your first time watching you want to see more of these videos look below you're going to see the word subscribe just click on it and you will be subscribed thank you all for watching and i'll see you in my next video Bye bye